Artificial insemination is becoming more and more popular in the beef industry as a way of introducing superior genetics into herds. Although there are many good stock bulls available with high EBVs, these can often be quite expensive to buy. There are also costs associated with keeping a bull on farm and bulls can only be kept for a certain amount of time before you run into trouble with serving his daughters. AI can therefore often be a realistic alternative for many suckler producers. However, getting a technician to come and serve your cattle can also be tricky as breeding companies are moving to, towards a more whole herd approach and less and less technicians are available to suckler producers. AHDB Beef and Lamb is offering funding to suckler producers to cover 50% of the cost of a DIY AI course, enabling producers to take control of their own breeding strategies. James Shuler farms a herd of pedigree cementals near Bista, Oxfordshire. James did his AI training with Bishopton Vets in Ripon, North Yorkshire this summer. The DIY AI um, made a lot of sense for us. We were struggling to uh, get our cows served by the AI technicians in our area when the timings were correct. So it made uh, a logical step forward to try and get more of it done in-house and get better timings. I think that was the biggest step forward with it. Also, we do quite a few embryo programs every year um, and the timings of those are really difficult to do. I think the biggest reason behind it was that we have a, uh, a good stock bull who realistically needs to stay here for a long time and being able to keep serving his daughters back behind him meant that the longevity of the bull um, could maybe go past four or five years without him serving his own daughters and stopping the inbreeding. I did the course at Bishopton Vets. It was a three day course. It was a very hands on course and very practical. Um, the first couple of days were very sort of classroom based with an amount of uh, practical work with it. And then the last day was completely on farm trying to uh, make sure that everything we had learned we were able to put into practice. So going forward, um, I bought a tank and I bought my kit um, from the vet practice while I was up there. I'm looking to serve our heifers, um, predominantly match them with some high EBV bulls um, and try to bring some different bloodlines into our herd at the moment. How do I see the cost of a bull versus AI? It cost me £600 to get a tank and get the kit to be able to do it. Um, by comparison to um, a stock bull, our stock bull um, across the autumn and spring herd, we need to achieve roughly 300 calves over sort of five to six years from him. Uh, by comparison, AI is a very cost effective way going forward on some farms. So by using AI, we're able to focus on certain EBVs. For us, as a herd producing good um, suckler cows with a long longevity, uh, self-replacing indexes are probably the bit we focus on more than anything else. My advice to farmers who are thinking about going and doing the course is to not be scared off by your lack of experience. The course teaches you everything you need to know and the genetic upgrade afterwards could be huge, which in turn will have a really big impact on your bottom line. Courses are being run by approved trainers across England. For more information or to find out where your nearest course is, visit the AHDB Beef and Lamb website.